Hey, how's it going? Z-Man the Tech here. I want to thank you for tuning in to Snowly Games. As always, I appreciate you very much. And uh, yeah, I'm about to hop into some Daytona USA on Sega Saturn, recorded natively. Um, and uh, yeah, let's go ahead and uh, take a look at the options here, see what we have. All right, uh, normal. We'll leave it on normal. And we'll just do arcade mode here. <clears throat> let's go to key assign real quick. So accelerate is C, brake is B. Okay, cool. All right, it's been a while since I played this, so oof, I'm gonna be horrible. But we'll jump into arcade. Please select a race course. All right, so we'll do uh, one uh, one of each, and um, yeah, go from there. Please choose manual or automatic transmission. Gentlemen, I want to say with the Saturn mode, you can unlock more vehicles. Um, uh, the uh, the more races you win and stuff like that. Oh man, this song. Whoa! Kind of skid out when I started it. Freaked me out. Now this version in particular, it's it's uh it's not the greatest in comparison to its arcade counterpart, but uh yeah, it I again it was one of my first three games, so I I absolutely loved it. I want to say it was, uh, I didn't have split screen or anything either, so it was pretty much just what it was. You know, the, the games later on kind of perfected things, at least on the Saturn anyway. Oh no! Oh man! Oh man, we got to get this fixed. So we got eight laps, so I mean, we might be okay. I mean, really, it, it, this is more beneficial when you do, like, the really, really long, uh, you know, the endurance, you know, type races where you have a lot of time to actually come back. <laughs> so I think they've already went around <laughs> a whole nother time since I got my pit work done. work my way up Ooh, that was horrible <laughs> yeah, you touch that grass uh, any little bit at all you're you're gonna skid out like crazy I'm working on it Let's see change the view a little bit here might even be easier Oh, I've already I've already messed up the hood. <laughs> you can take it. You're looking good. Take your position. Oh, I'm so horrible at this. Jeez. Had to get my time extended and everything. I want to say, if you don't go to the pit, you'll you'll not be able to drive as good or fast. So, oh wow, okay, thirty fifth. Man, I have not touched this game in a long time. I I got so good at this game back in the day. Oh man, I am trash now. I almost didn't want to include that <laughs> on the on the roster at all. All right, uh, I, I think I need to try that one more time. That's uh, that was horrible. If I can get better at, at making that one turn, I think it, it'll be fine. But otherwise, I'm gonna be struggling. But yeah, the better version is to get the uh, the championship edition, if I'm not mistaken. Um, there was a couple of other ones, or at least the Japanese version was was supposed to be the best. Um, which I'm I, I am looking for that. Uh, 
Uh, a lot of the Japanese Japanese versions of the games are fairly cheaper, um, but you know you do have the. Uh... Oh my gosh, that was awesome! Okay, I figured it out now. Got the drift in there. Um, but yeah, uh, uh, they're typically a little cheaper since you know, for one, you have to pretty much be able to read Japanese to play them. But games like this, like fighting games and racing games, you're pretty much be okay. Um, some of them even actually have uh, English text in them, so you, you can get lucky with some of them. But I have a uh, pseudo pseudo Kai, I think it's called Saturn card coming for the uh, cartridge slot pretty soon here. So pretty excited about that. Be able to play my uh, my import games and burn games if I wanted to, but I don't want to wear down the laser, so I'm just gonna keep it keep it to the OEM stuff <laughs> um, but yeah I have a few Japanese titles uh, Virtua Fighter 1 Virtua Fighter Kids and uh, Virtual On which I'm very very excited to play that oh man that's such an amazing game much cheaper to get the Japanese version so went ahead and did that so uh, once I get that card I'll be doing some gameplays of that too as well, some let's plays. But it also it also gives you uh, RAM expansion for the games that require it, um, like X Men versus Street Fighter, and you know most of the Capcom games like Street Fighter Alpha Two and stuff like that um, kind of required a little more RAM to play. So. Doing all right this time. Doing all right. But this version of the of the music is so much better, though. Like Sega Saturn, this this version had the best music. Because I tried to, uh, I got the uh, the digital version of the. I want to say it's like a like a remaster of the arcade version that's on uh, Xbox 360. I, I, I played it a while back and got some footage on it. Um, visually, it's stunning, but for some reason, that music got butchered. Like the original singer was like auto-tuned or something. I'm not sure what they did with that. Uh, didn't sound good at all, but this version sounds really good. Kind of, it kind of became a cult classic in music. <laughs> um, but yeah, his uh, his singing's really good. It's really good. Uh, but yeah, let's go ahead and uh, we did pretty good on that one. Got seventh place. So yeah, Please let's go ahead and uh, go to advanced. Please choose manual mode, automatic transmission. Gentlemen, start your engine. Yeah, that turn could be really rough coming out of that uh, little tunnel area. <laughs> Still really rough to this day, really, to be honest. Even on the uh, remastered uh, version. <laughs> Got to get better at uh, at drifting. As long as we don't crash, I think we'll be good. But there was a steering wheel for Saturn. I've never used it, so I'm not really sure how accurate it felt or, you know, anything like that. I'm not really too much interested in it. But uh, I mean, if I found one for cheap, I'd probably get it for sure.
Oh, I knew it. <laughs> Dang it. Just touched that wall a little too hard on that turn. I mean, going to high speed like that, it's, it's definitely, you know, a given that it's going to happen. my position. It's going to be a while to catch up now after that crash. I don't know if I'll ever get back to 12 or 11. Yeah, so I should have hit the brakes just like I did there on that part. Yeah, that one crash screwed me up bad. Man. <laughs> Probably could put my name in, I'm sure. Yeah. It's one of those games that you really, really, like, it's addictive when it comes to, like, uh, you trying to get the best time or get in first in general, you know. It's, it's very, very addictive. Basically, you can't crash, though, like, <laughs> as you can see. Like, it makes it really hard to, like, uh, to reach the uh, checkpoint. <laughs> kind of glitched through me there. Oh, that's the pit. Oh, man. Cold-blooded. I forgot how difficult this one is. <laughs> ah. Jeffrey statue there. I doubt if I'm gonna make it to 25th place. Like this is crazy. There's only two dang laps on this one. a little harder. Man, I don't even see the other racers. Like <laughs> this is ridiculous. Oh, like according to the map, they're way up there. Holy crap. Yeah, this is I don't know man. Some it's not it's not even it's not even worth trying to finish the race. Yeah. Might as well just crash and call it call it a dang race. Jeez. <laughs> 
It's like twenty-eight. Yeah, you can't. You cannot mess up at all. Jeez. Oh man. Sorry for the crappy gameplay, but uh, <laughs> I need uh, I need some practice. It's been a while. Um, but anywho, I uh, hope you enjoyed it, even though I wasn't very good at it. Uh, uh, Daytona USA on the Saturn, natively, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> but uh, anywho, um, if you like what you saw, definitely like, comment, subscribe. Remember to keep it locked to Snow League Games for all of your indie game, third-party game, tech review coverage, and sometimes Nintendo and retro games thrown in the mix, all right? You have a good one. Take care. Futuristic classic. The futuristic classic. Time is of the essence. I feel like I got it mastered. Futuristic classic. The futuristic classic. It's always moving forward, so I'm never moving backwards.